Here's a pair of Beat Solo Pro headphones. I'm gonna show you how to pair and connect these directly to a Chromebook via Bluetooth. First thing is go to your Bluetooth settings on your Chromebook. You can tap on the launcher right there and then bring up all the apps. I have to tap on this uh, up arrow. Now you wanna to go to your settings, okay? So we're gonna to go to settings right here. Now from here, we wanna go and select Bluetooth right there, okay? So I'm gonna select on Bluetooth. Make sure this Bluetooth is turned on, okay? Now, let's just leave it like this. Let's go to our headphones here. And what we wanna do is put these in pairing mode, okay? So these are currently off. Let me go ahead and open these up. And now they're on. Just FYI, guys, if you close one of these, it turns it off, okay? So let's open up both of them. And let's wait for the light to turn on. Okay, so the light is on, and there's a button on the other headphone here. So what I want to do is, I, what I want is a white blinking light indicating, indicating that's in pairing mode, okay? So I have this one button here. I'm going to press and hold. I'm going to keep on holding this button until this starts blinking white. I'm just, okay, so now it's blinking white. Now I'm going to let go. So now it's in pairing mode, okay? So, oh, I don't want to close those. Oh, I just closed it. It was off. Okay, let's put it back into pairing mode, okay? I'm going to press and hold again. And just wait till it starts blinking. Okay, it's blinking. It's in pairing mode. Now, we're going to come over here to our uh, Chromebook here. Now, I'm going to tap on pair new device. Right there. Select that. Now, it's searching for devices that are in pairing mode that's nearby me, okay? It's still in pairing mode here. Now, we just got to wait for the Beat Solo. Okay, it says Solo, uh, Solo Pro right there. Okay, so let me go ahead and select that. Beat Solo or Solo Pro, okay? So now we're connected, all right? Now, if you had issues where you couldn't connect or you couldn't pair it or put in a pairing mode, you can always reset these as well. If you need to do that, look in the link below. Anyway, we're connected, ready to go on here.